Chris was an illustrator first of all. He has been working in the media uh, for news. He has published books. His art is really accessible. And he represents artists who talk about tradition and culture in Uganda. His work will resonate with most people. It has elements which are familiar to them. And his technique is superb. The work is beautiful to look at. Consciousness is the start of a show, first of all, a series of exhibitions that are under the same theme, consciousness and inner fundamentals. That's just to break them down. And here I'm working with the whole multiple themes, duality, uh, love and hate, spirituality, sexuality, mental health, you know, life and death, food as medicine, transcendence or inner peace, to mention but a few. I bring to you a show where I show you the things that I have learned, things that I have experienced. Now I am about to showcase my journey as I grow, as I get to understand, you know? So it's almost an honor for you who sees this work because we are taking a step together. Consciousness is wide as a theme and it encircles all aspects of our livelihood. Peace like consent has to, <laughs> has to resonate with you. That piece tells a woman that uh, what you zip up is yours. So yes, they are provocative because these messages and these, these areas really are, are hard to talk about. You see, like sexuality. Sexuality is not something you sit with your folks and say, now I, I want a boyfriend. Uh, Africa has been concealed on messages like this. So now we are starting an awakening where you are free, you know, to talk about these things that are you. That's what consciousness is really. COVID, by far, it was, it was not just a challenge, yeah, but it was an inspiration. We have a show in COVID, you know, everyone second guessed it. Say, now you put up a show in a time like now. I'm like, if not now, when? I have a piece about time. It says there's only now. COVID-19, if it didn't challenge you, to introspectively go back home and understand that money won't save you. So you see, capitalism won't win a time like this. So relevance, COVID-19 is one of the reasons I put up this show now. It's been an opportunity in crisis. What stood out for me was the art piece on consent. Yeah, I felt that was very special. And I also got the vibe that the artist is a little bit feminist. <laughs> I don't know why. Yeah, but yeah, everything was really amazing. I think every piece tells a story, which is beautiful. And I also think that it's well thought through. It evokes thought. And I like the way the particular artist mixes different. He can do like five different themes in one whole art piece. And it's just interesting for me. What Quizera has displayed here is a myriad of very many expressions. Like, he picks the right material to depict a given aspect. Like, uh, there was uh, an art piece that was showing worms and uh, nature. And there is that feel of, like, the muddy texture. And you feel like, okay, what's this? And you, you get to touch it and you're like, you know what? I think I'm transcending. I think he's the kind of person who is an activist who would like speak out like hey things like consent like hey it's the woman with the consent not just anyone else so i have that kind of feeling that hey he's actually principled and stuff